Well, hello there, Scorpio. Cause every time I close my eyes, I think of you. It don't matter what the season is, I still love you. With all my heart, I want to be with you forever. Wherever you are. Down, 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 down. <laughs> I love that song, you guys. I hope you guys like it too. Okay, you guys, Scorpio. Listen up, listen up, listen up, listen up. You've got powerful divine feminine energies around you. And they are protecting you. Okay? You are being protected from things that you don't even know about. Or maybe you have a feeling, but you, you don't, know about, don't, don't know about. There's a powerful feminine energy, divine feminine energy. And I have picked this up in the Libra reading, I think, and the Gemini reading as well. Um, and she's around you anyway. It's um, a, a mother figure. So it could be a mother, a grandmother, an aunt, and so on. Um, there is something about a curse being broken and negativity being removed from you moving forward. There's fire being sent to your, to your enemies, okay? Um, I'm hearing they're being drowned with water and burned with fire. <laughs> That's someone who's very upset about something, okay, in the spirit realm from your ancestors who are breaking this negativity from around you that someone else has done to you in an unfairly. I feel the energy of a coward, a cowardly energy, someone working in the dark to hurt you. They can't face up to you face to face. They need to be hidden. They need to be hiding behind a computer or a screen or something of some kind. Okay. Um, they have. I'm getting the energy of a thief. Someone who stole things. Okay. Either from you or from other people. I don't know what that is. But see how that resonates with you. Usually my readings are all positive and lovey-dovey. But I have to say the message that I get. <laughs> I love you guys. I'm feeling so much love from you guys. Uh, look, this person is getting their karma, okay? And I think you're going to hear about it for sure, 100 million percent, very soon, okay? So they're saying, don't worry and don't panic yourself. Don't be, um, you know, um, negative in any way because you only have positive things coming towards you. Your energy is very pure. It's very clean. It's very elevated. It's very high. Your physical strength is improving as well. And your health is really becoming amazing, okay? You're starting to be, to look a lot better as well, <laughs> is what they're saying to me. I don't know what that means, but maybe you've changed your style or you're like kind of like working out or, you know, trying to look better. I feel that you're getting rid of a lot of negative things and that, you know, you, are, you, know, you know now what works of you, for you and what doesn't. The dose is in the poison. All the wise people know <laughs> uh, the poison is in the dose, I mean. So you, you know, you, you just see what works for you and what doesn't and you cut that out, okay? Um, and I feel that um, you are wise enough to know that, okay? You're like um, the, what, the queen of discs or, <laughs> you know, something that energy, yeah? The king of discs or the queen of discs. Um, more like the queen of discs I'm getting because she knows that the, the, the dose, the poison is in the dose is what I'm hearing. That's such a funny message. I love you guys so much. I'm feeling so much love from you guys. So you are getting elevated to new heights. You've got the energy of success and stardom with you as well. You've got the energy of the sun that is on your side that is coming to you from an ancestral connection. The sun disc energy. Yes, the sun disc is what I'm hearing. Um, and it is illuminating your path and illuminating your work to others so that people can see the, the amazing, beautiful, glorious things that you get up to, okay? And they are going to be bringing a lot of healing to people. Um, there's an energy of someone who is by the sea or by water as well. I know you're a water sign, but you live by water probably. If you're, if this reading resonates with you and you live by water, let me know in the comments, you guys. You've got water or you maybe someone close to the water is going to be talking to you. You're going to be talking to someone across the water. Could be as well. 
mm, across the water, across an ocean, across a river, across a spring, across the tap. I don't know. <laughs> I'm joking, you guys. I love you guys. But it's going to be um, something very nice, very high vibrational, elevated connection, lovely connection. Very protective as well, energy. You are protective over this person, are so protective over this person, and that's beautiful. And I feel that that person be feels that from you, okay? And they really um, yeah, appreciate it. Again, I'm seeing energy of a crescent, a crescent and a star, okay? A crescent, a star? No, just a crescent, a crescent. A crescent, and that is, could be New Orleans, Turkey, something like that. We can... Muslim, see how that resonates with you. It can, it can have many meanings, but they show me a big crescent. You could also be connected to the phases of the moon, like I am, and you feel them when they're coming um, and where they're changing. Okay, so you've got a lot of uh, spiritual energy. There's big changes coming into your life. Okay, and I'm seeing nine and nine again. So these are changes, the completion of cycles and going into new cycles. I'm hearing of love and understanding, okay? You, there's a lot of toxicity and negativity that's being left in the past. I'm feeling so much love from you guys. Thank you so much. And there's a big love connection, a big victory with regards to love, with regards to matters of the heart that's coming towards you, Scorpio, in whatever that you're doing. So I'm feeling that you are also like um, being elevated to new heights. I'm seeing the letter J in someone's name or the letter I in another person's name or the same person could be as well um and and the letter s for sugar i'm seeing as well um i'm also seeing uh that could be anywhere in the first or second names by the way you guys it doesn't have to be the initial um so i'm seeing these letters see how it resonates with you guys any other letters m m for mother yeah in someone's name um the middle of the name okay in the middle of the name Okay. S M J I or E E um the I uh M. Yeah. So there is a love connection here that's being illuminated. Someone has been a little bit shy, but they're saying don't be shy, go for it, okay? And it's going to be amazing and beautiful. I feel that the feminine energy in this connection is extremely beautiful. I feel that he or she has connections to the East or the Middle East could be as well. Very beautiful uh, person, gorgeous, nice smelling person. <laughs> I'm healing fragrant, fragrant, someone who is very fragrant. Um, and I'm feeling that uh, this is something, it's such a beautiful fragrance though that I'm smelling. It's very deep and, and sensual and sensual like oud wood or um, amber or uh, sandalwood, these kinds of musk, these kinds of beautiful aromas. So I'm feeling so much love, you guys. Thank you so much. This is, this is beautiful, you guys. Um, Pete, you, you are... Um, very trustworthy and people trust you so i feel that if this community there's communication that's happening and if this communication happens whoever the, uh, you're talking to is going to trust your energy because i feel that they also are intuitive and they might actually feel that it's coming towards them okay or they know about it they've known about it for a long time longer than maybe you know as well as well okay is what i'm hearing okay so that person has known they've seen your face a long time before you saw theirs is what I'm hearing. And it's not uh, what you think. They didn't see it on a computer or on a screen or anything like that. They saw it in a vision. And now when, when they saw you, they know that it's you. You're the person that they saw in whatever capacity that may be as a friend or as a partner, a lover, whatever it is. Uh, they saw your face. So there is a connection here, okay, of some kind. Okay, and I, I think it's worth exploring and seeing what's going on with, the, with it. It's a beautiful connection. And the divine feminine energy that's on your side uh, is, that is protecting you is connected to this love connection very strongly, very strongly. <laughs> like she's bringing it and bringing money as well and wealth to you and riches. Okay, so I feel the energy of someone who's such a powerful healer. There's a connection as well to ancient Egypt and to East Africa, to the Nile. I was born 10 minutes away from the Nile, so... 
Um, welcome, welcome. Brethren, sisters, brothers. <laughs> so, you guys, I love you guys so much. You guys are beautiful, Scorpio. Um, all positive things are coming to you now. All your problems are, le are you leaving behind. You're going into um, this new moon with a fresh energy, with a beautiful fresh energy, and everything is going to be okay. You're going to be all smiles, happy, 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 happy. And you're going to be um, elevated to new and amazing, incredible heights. And you're going to feel that everything is very stable for you and that you feel completely from all of the negativity that has ever tried to mess with you before. Okay, I love you guys so much. I'm going to leave it here for you guys, Scorpio. But I will, and I will see you guys in your next reading. Please remember to like, share and subscribe, you guys. Big hugs and kisses from us. And I will see you guys soon. Thank you, Scorpio.